Republican candidate has uh, something they want to bring up related to the answer, they get a minute. So here we go. Ruth, you're first. What purpose does serving on city council fulfill for you and or why is it important? And what are your three top priorities if elected and why? I think I already answered that. And I hope you mean mayor because that's what I intend to be. Um, but I think that the reason we need to be serving is because we have a community that's growing. And as our community grows and our businesses grow, we need to make sure that we have that vision that brings them to the future. As I've said, my top priority is our public safety. We need to make sure that we are supporting our police, that we have enough officers to fulfill that job. We need to make sure that we are looking forward and not just serving for today. Our second thing that we need to be focused on is our homeless population. I believe that the rise in homelessness in this city is something that could alter our future if we don't address it and get a handle on that. I also believe that transparency is important. As your mayor, I'm here to serve. I'm not here to be in charge as much as I am to listen to your voices and make sure that you're aware of what's happening in your own city. I think it's important that we have a voice and listen to our residents as we move forward, as well as our business leaders, because they drive our economic prosperity. Thank you. Mayor Arke, you can either respond or you can answer the question. I'll just answer the question. Okay. So my top priorities are uh, hiring and retention across the city, certainly in including our sworns and non-sworns that work for our police department. Uh, we are doing that by, and we'll continue to search out new solutions, but we are offering more solutions like the ones announced five days ago. We currently have hired 59 sworns and non-sworn as part of our police officer, te our police team since the beginning of 2021, 40 in this fiscal year. We'll continue till we reach our complement of 360 and in the current budget that we'll be approving, we'll be adding some more to the same. We put an additional 50 million into PSPRS. I plan on paying that down to zero in my second term. So number two is build out and housing that will accommodate the continued relocation of, head, of headquarters, building expansions and more jobs to Chandler. We've never had more headquarters. We've never had more expansions or jobs in this community. We currently have 265 uh, manufacturing companies in Chandler. And thirdly, working with council to keep the city fiscally sound, structurally balanced, and the cost of service low. We currently have the lowest cost of service that Chandler has ever seen, and um, we're lower than our neighbors, and uh, this even includes sales tax. So making sure that we're continually prepared for the future fiscally is my goals. And 